What is going on? It's your boy Warner Brother, and we are back with some more Need for Speed No Limits episode 434 for day one of the Road to the West the live event with the McLaren 600 LT. Let's dive straight into it. But before we do, I know I accidentally pressed it. Let's go ahead and grab our final free upgrade crate of the day. Continuing on from the last episode. We'll go ahead and do that real quickly, real briefly. Let's go ahead and knock this thing out the park. We get a nitro segment. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Thank you very much. Let's go ahead and snag that. Thank you. And then let's go ahead and grab our premium crate. That's right, the premium crate. One of the good crates. Here we go. Crack it open. Let's see what we got. Oh, a fair lady blueprints. Let's go ahead and do a re-roll. Let's see what else we can get. Ooh, okay. We'll go with this for now. And do another re-roll. Just see what we get. We're going to stick with those. Even though we could use the scrap points, I, I want to try to save. I want to try to actually get more blueprints for cars that I know I need blueprints for. So, one more last re roll. Mm, that is tempting. Should we go with the Mercedes AMG blueprints and actually work our way to staging up the car? Or should we work on getting blueprints for the Venom GT and potentially get a brand new one, even though that's going to take a lot longer? I think we'll just stick with these. We'll go with these. Guys, eventually we're going to do that event that's in the vault anyway. So. Now that we've done all that, let's dive straight in to Road to the West. So this is another Chinese New Year one. This was back in the Year of the Dragon, I believe, two years ago. Yeah, this was two years ago. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes, my favorite monk master, Mr. Tang. You, I see all your desires. They are vast and unending, but they are pure. You tread a virtuous road to your destination. I am Tang, and I am in need of an individual such as yourself to complete my journey. This road will only end when I retrieve my family's lost relic, forgotten to these lands for many years. Your job will be driving. Take me on the road to the relic, and in exchange, you will keep this God. Okay. Why did I sound Arabic there? I have no clue. So we have a brand new loan car. We have the McLaren 600 LT in this beautiful wrap. I absolutely love the wrap on this car. This thing looks absolutely spicy. And it sits at a beautiful 680. I dig it. I dig it a lot. So, of course, completing the event, we get a five-star McLaren 600 LT with the beautiful wrap added to it. So, let's dive straight in to day one. Tang. Briefly, let's check out the Lunar Store. So we do have ECU segment and transmission segment to grab. Now, this particular event, we are not spending gold on. Not spending a single piece of gold for any of this stuff. Because we need the gold for a different event that we're going to start at the same time as this one. So, diving straight in. Time trial, Nitro Rush, Rush Hour, second time trial, and an airborne race. So this first time trial, I will cut my mic so you can enjoy the sounds of this McLaren 600 LT.
You know, I'm not spending any gold on this car, but damn it, it makes me want to because look how awesome not only the car is, but the environment. You got the fireworks in the background. Of course, you got the sparklers and the tires when it drifts. Such a small window of time, and yet you already handled this machine as if it were an extension of yourself. It has been many years of tedious progress on my own. Your abilities will prove invaluable on this journey. Oh man, I love the Lunar New Year events, even though I don't necessarily celebrate the Lunar New Year's like like that anyways. But man, oh man, it is super cool to see. Oh man, I'm super excited about doing this event. And, and I kind of want to push to win this car. So that means I'm going to have to be doing a lot of grinding outside of the episodes. So that means some of the other stuff I'm going to have to either hold off on or just limit. Which I plan on just limiting it. I don't, don't want to put stuff off any more than I have to. I am certain the relic is here in Blackridge. We need only to search. Oh yeah, the red exhaust flames. I wonder if we keep all that when we, if we keep this car. Dragon, that's dope. My driving wasn't the greatest, but it's okay. Doing a fantastic job. <sighs> Good stuff. Ah, this city. Just like home. You're kidding. You are from a big city. You must be from like Beijing or Shanghai or something. All right, rush hour race up next. We get a time trial after a second time trial after the fact. We're doing fan freaking fantastic. Well, we got to go up against Frank in their Ford GT from 2006. Very nice car, actually. I haven't driven it in this game yet, but I've driven it in other racing games, and it's, it's a doozy. It's a good-ass car. Greetings, traveler. We are looking for an ancient relic lost to my people for many years. Do you know of its whereabouts? Whoa, uh, sure. But I'll only say if you raise me. Very well. Since this is not me at the wheel, I will gladly accept. Sweet! Because I'm not spending any money to get any gold at the current moment, I the gold is going to have to be, uh, basically, I'm going to have to say about Our race is complete. Now, the relic locations, please. That is one really fast car. Damn, I had to see it for myself to believe it. Uh, oh, yeah, sorry. I don't know anything about no relic. I just wanted a race. Promises should not be made lightly, young one. Sure, my bad. I mean, you can hear the fireworks in the background. That is so damn cool. Man, I gotta try to win this car without spending gold. Oh, the road to the west is gonna be a very interesting event. Meanwhile, I really have to grind if I'm going to try to win this car. 
And hopefully I do. That, that would be great. I would love to try to win this car. Absolutely love to try to win it. And it'd be an amazing accomplishment if we do it without spending any gold. A common occurrence throughout my travels. Many believe I possess supernatural powers that can empower their racing machines. Based only on coincidence, but still many insist on perpetuating the rumor. <laughs> So basically what they're saying, he's some sort of mechanic. So basically what they're saying, he's like a bald Jackie Chan. For those of you who are not getting where I'm picking up what I'm putting down, basically they're saying because Jackie Chan did a movie in the 90s where he was a mechanic for Mitsubishi and built the Mitsubishi Evo 6 up into a race car. Uh, I forgot the name. I think it's called Thunderbolt. If you want to check out that movie. That is the second reason I require a driver. Protection. Some believe my mere presence will have an effect on their performance. Hearsay and ignorance are a truly troubling combination. So yes, definitely. Um, yeah. Definitely uh, worth the watch if you get a chance. I think it definitely would be worth the watch. Now, before we continue on to the final race, which is an airborne race, let's go ahead and work on the car. We have two of these turbo segments that we will add straight in to the car. Main focus will be on top speed, so engine and turbo materials are main priority because they will help us to get the performance rating we need a little bit faster than acceleration and nitro. Over to the wheel segments. So let's go ahead and add that in. Now we're at the performance rating that we need to be. And going over to the transmission to add in the transmission segment. Now we're just short of four grand, but we'll go ahead and do this airborne race and get our money up. So ECU seven for completing this race. And we'll go we'll go up against Slade. I also love the lighting too. The lighting is amazing. There you are. Get back in the trunk, old man. This one is blind to the profound promises of his fellow racers. Blind? No way! I was getting at least another five miles an hour out of you. Please do not allow him to subdue me again. I would much rather not spend any more days in that filthy place. I got you, Asian Mr. T. Let's go. We are the Dragon after. line under 25 seconds nice damn it now he's helping your car get away it's not fair fortunately my power is working in my favor this time heck yeah man that's awesome all right, we got the ECU segment. Good stuff, good stuff. All right, that is day one of the Road to West live event complete. We got the 10 blueprints right there. Good stuff. All right, just briefly and quickly, let's hop into the Lunar Store and grab that transmission segment. And that way we can add that into the car 
and make our moves from there. So it's a transmission. We're gonna go ahead and add that in right there. Alright, we are second transmission segment. Sitting now at 683. And over to the ECU so we can add the ECU segment. Alright, that's the good stuff. Alright, that will wrap it up for this episode of Need for Speed No Limits. Tune in next time for episode 3, 4, uh, sorry, 435 for day 2 of the Road to the West live event. Like and subscribe for more content. Also, for motorsports and gaming content, I will leave links to different channels in the description as well as a link to my Patreon so you become a member, help support the channel, and help me to provide better content. It's your boy, Waterbrother. Much love, much appreciation, and I'm out of here. Peace.